Hey, what is going on guys? Why well, I'm Echo back with another Tip Tuesday and today I'm going to have a quick little Tip Tuesday episode and it's going to be on weapon classes. Now, uh, people have asked me what guns I use and stuff, but you know, I haven't really clarified because the problem is I always change my class. Like before a game starts, I always go in and I change my class up because depending on what map it is, what the game type is, and what I feel like doing, uh, you know, I don't like having a standard class. Like, I do have a standard class if I really don't know what to use, and I, that's just a failsafe you can say. I'll show it to you in a second. But today I just want to give out a tip to uh, anyone who is like, oh, what's the best class to use? And my honest opinion, again, my opinion, is that there really isn't a best quote-unquote class. Now, I say that because everyone has a different play style, everyone has their own, like, favorite weapon class and weapon within the class, you know, and so no one's a copy of each other, so people use different guns for different reasons, like, for me, I've been using the Man of War lately, I've been using the KN-44 in the past, the, I the ICR, um... Shiva, and what else was there? Haymaker. Yeah, I've used all the assault rifles pretty evenly. And, like, honestly, I don't think anyone's better than the other. It just depends on what your play style is. Like, I like to rush. Uh, I play passively on longer game modes. Uh, High-paced game modes, I use uh, SMGs like the Razorback, VMP, Weevil, anything like that. And my perk actually, my perks actually stay relatively similar. Actually, uh, uh, depends on the game mode as well. So I've been talking and I haven't shown you guys anything on my classes. Oop. Let's go over here. Uh -huh. So here's my Man of War class. This is my pretty. This is my standard class. This is my fail-safe class. This is the class I use. So I don't know what to use, and this that's all I use now. Depending on what I'm doing, so for example, if I go up to my custom eight over here, I have the man of war with different optics and attachments, with the black cell and just awareness, uh, fast hands and afterburners. I use this for safeguard. Now I say that because safeguard you have the robot and the robot, and the black cell is super effective against the robot and uh, score streaks. I have awareness on because I do have a headset and. Uh, you know, safeguards a long game mode, and I need to be able to hear where everyone's at. My man of warriors have ELO sight because why not? I have an extra slot open. Quick draw is a must. It is a must for me, at least. Might not be for you. Stock uh, is a must for me, and rapid fire very important when uh, playing safeguard. Next, I have my rushing Brecci class. Not, not Brecci, my Bakaram class, and then I have my rushing Brecci class. There we go, there it is. So I used a Brecci uh, in Safeguard as well. Uh, I like to rush. Now, here I am uh, giving you a good example of what to use uh, when you feel like it. So I'll be playing Safeguard, and I use my Man of War class, for example, most of the time, or my KN44 class, wherever it is, it's up there. And. I won't be feeling the vibe, you know? I'll be like in the game lobby before the game starts, like, you know what? I feel like rushing, right? So I'll put on a good specialist. I have overclock on this class so I can get that faster. Afterburner, blast suppressor, stuff like that. I have rapid fire, fast mag, and extended clip on here. So the Brecci is a perfect gun for me when it comes to rushing. And then do I have an SM do I have an SMG on this somewhere? Maybe I took it off. I took my, I took my SM oh there it is my Weevil class. So there's my Weevil class. Uh, that's also for safeguard. I play a lot of safeguard guys. I'm sorry. Lately at least I play a lot of domination too. So I have my Weevil. I have quick draw and grip, and then I have a uh, blast suppressor, awareness, fast hands, afterburner, and ghosts for those pesky UAVs. And so this is my SMG rush class. All right, guys. So it just depends on your play style, you know. So, I don't know, maybe a couple of you guys like to use the ICR, for example. Here's a good ICR class. you got Quick Draw, Stock, and Rapid Fire. And then the perks are all up to you. I don't recommend using any perk of, over any other one. Mm, well, actually, Afterburners, if you do uh, use your Afterburners a lot, not Afterburners, uh, your Boosts a lot, uh, and Blast Suppressor is crucial. Uh, blast Suppressor should be on your class, like, as many times as possible, like, if not every single time. Or, uh, Dead Silence, but I don't use Dead Silence, I like Blast Suppressor better, because I boost around a lot more than I run around. And, yeah, so, I have some, if, if you've seen the gameplay on the side, you know, I, I use all these guns, so, and they're all equally good. I don't prefer anyone over the other, it just depends on the situation, like, this XR2 class, 
I used that on like bigger maps like Hunted for those long range gunfights. And then I have uh, right now I have Overclock on it because I've been trying to rush with assault rifles lately. So that's what I mean, guys. It's all up to you. I just can throw out some some, some suggestions, but really, uh, when you make a, a custom class, you know it should really be a custom class, not create a class. It's a custom, but they have custom on there, so it's all up to you. I can throw suggest suggestions. All I like to do. But at the end of the day, it's your class. You can do whatever you like. You can use whatever class you want. You can use snipers, LMGs, shotguns, assault rifles, whatever floats your boat, whatever you like to use. That's what you should use. That's what I do. I don't nitpick on what I do. I'm like, oh, I feel like using this. I use or using this or this or this or this or this, you know? I'm not like, oh, everyone seems to be using this gun. I should use that one or this one or this one, you know? I mean, sure, some guns have, uh, you know, advantage. When I mean advantage, I mean they haven't been nerfed or buffed. So, I mean they haven't been uh, nerfed yet. But uh, the, all the guns have been pretty balanced lately. So I could honestly say that, yeah, all the guns are equal at this point. Not perfectly, but better than when the game first came out. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys got any kind of insight, learned something from this video. I hope you enjoyed it very much, as much as I did trying to teach you guys. And if you liked it, leave a like down below. Have any thoughts or any comment suggestions, leave them down in the comment section below. And, uh, yeah, if you're not subscribed already, make sure you do that as well so you keep up to date with all of my latest videos. I upload pretty often, not extravagantly, but I upload enough in a week where you can have a bunch of new stuff to watch whenever you have some free time and uh yeah that is it my friends i will catch you guys in my next video peace out what are you waiting for do it just do it yes you can just do it